I'm nearly 40 this year and my son is eight and he's getting into photography. And if you follow me on Instagram or social media, Facebook, wherever it may be, I have an entirely different platform where really I showcase photography. On my YouTube channel, I talk about tech and reviews and everything that goes with digital planning and note taking and how to maximize your efficiency and productivity and personal growth and development. And my son said to me the other day, dad, grandma, when did she be able to see color? And I looked at her and I said, what? He says, well, all the photos are black and white and all the movies that she loves is black and white. And I said, son, color is a technology upgrade. It's not a way of life. We experience color and have forever. And I explained that to him, but the technology just didn't process in his mind in a way that he got it. Well, I introduced him to a product that Onyx Books just recently came out with and showcased how at one time e-technology and e-ink, that handwriting experience was one thing and how today it's another thing. Guys, I'm gonna show you a product today that's going to blow your mind, expand your capabilities, and give you a fresh look on what it means to take notes, plan your day, and be able to synchronize those notes across all your different devices, if it be Windows, Apple, or Android. We're bringing color to your notes and productivity. What makes this product even more unique is it's not just a tool for handwriting. You can go ahead and get this device with a keyboard as well as that stylus. That keyboard is gonna expand and open up opportunities for you to utilize different applications on the Google Play Store, such as Google Docs, Word, and other text instruments that you can use to process letters, notations, jump into your email and respond to emails, all while using a keyboard. What makes that keyboard even more exceptional, it is the cover for the device, giving you protection. So no matter wherever you go with this device, you not only have a cover and case for your Onyx books, but you also have a keyboard. So you can make those notes, process those Word documents, and reply to those emails wherever you are and wherever you are going. Also with that comes the ability to use the camera. This camera is exceptionally well for scanning the documents. I found that if I have a document that I need to sign or if there's an application or note that I wanna go ahead and mark up, I can easily take a picture of that with this device, pull it in, make the necessary adjustments, sign that form and send it off. When I look at this tool overall, it's more than just an e-ink device. When I looked at this device compared to the Remarkable in previous videos, Remarkable is a digital note tab. It is distraction free. And you have many of those same capabilities with the Onyx Books, but you're plus up with some of the technology that comes with the dev this device, being an Android product, having a keyboard, and being able to access that Google Play Store. It really is a device that's gonna be mobile and flexible for you that is based off of e-technology. Ultimately, what attracted me most to this device was the fact that when we introduced color, to this e-ink device, we now have the ability to use highlighting tools. And if those of you that are in the digital note taking or digital planning arena, you're gonna understand the big benefit of this. Being able to go through and highlight, place color inside our notes is gonna help us segregate information, if it be personal or professional. And if you're in planning, often I like to use highlighter to identify if this is a work meeting, a personal meeting, if it's something that I've done or haven't done, and I can now easily do that, versus on traditional e-ink devices like the Remarkable and a black and white version of the same tablet, I can't designate the color palette between here you see a cyan color and an orange color that helps you indicate what it is. And you can go ahead in OneNote and you can change the different color options and different color palettes. Also, you have the ability to use color pen tools. And I think this is a big update because sometimes what I like to do is when I'm marking up a document, you know, I'll use black as my annotation pen of choice, but then I might use another color to offset any changes or updates that I want to see when it comes to note taking. Now, when it comes to digital planning, uh, this device is very responsive when it comes to being able to move inside of OneNote. There's other applications that you can use as well. And like I'll talk about later, we're gonna deep dive into some of those applications. But for OneNote, I can go ahead and I can choose a pen and write a note and it quickly responds to my annotation that I'm making on the page. I can go ahead and use that lasso tool 
and select that note and I can choose to move it. Where this is really powerful when it comes to digital planning, let's just say for example I wasn't able to complete some of these tasks. And if you guys like EAA or like photography, you guys are going to want to check out my social media page because we were just at the EAA show which is a, the world's largest um, experimental enthusiasts in the aircraft in aviation industry and we took some awesome photos so I'll put one of those up here on the screen and if you haven't check out all of them on my social media pages you're gonna love them but I went ahead and I copied that I can come now over to the next page if I jumped a little too fast for you guys just rewind a little bit there and now hit paste and what this allowed me to do is take those annotations or those to do's that I wasn't able to finish from the one day and take them over to the next day. And that's really powerful when it comes to digital planning. But yet it still gives me the ability to say, you know what, this task here doesn't have the same priority it did yesterday or it has a higher priority today because I wasn't able to finish it. And as you see here, the different color palettes that are being chosen with the highlighter help me organize uh, my notes. So guys, this is pretty cool, this is pretty exciting. If you guys wanna learn more about the planner, I encourage you to do so by checking out keychsuccessplanner.com. I want you guys to learn more about this product and I'm going to do a deep dive on it talking about some of the different efficiencies, different tools, and different apps that I use every day with it. And if you guys want to learn more about that, take a moment, subscribe to our channel. If you've learned just one thing in it, please do me a favor and like it. If you've got questions, go ahead and hit the comments myself or somebody else in the community. I'm sure will reach out to you and answer those questions. And guys, if you learned just one thing, please do me a favor and share that with your neighbor. Share that with your colleagues so we can grow this audience together. I'm Brandon Bonifer, creator and founder of the Key to Success Planner. And Lord willing, guys, I'll get to see each and every one of you in the next video. So God bless.